We're with um, Deputy Fire Chief Dwayne Church right now, and uh, Dwayne, kind of talk to us a little bit about what's going on. Um, you mentioned obviously there's a trucking fire or trunking company fire right here on Oakland Avenue. Yeah, this morning before five o'clock, uh, we received a call from a passerby who advised that they had flames in the air. So uh, first units arrived and we did have a building that was fully engulfed in flames. Uh, Smith Trucking Company is the name of the business. Uh, at that point, we went into a defensive mode of action. So uh, currently right now, we've got aerial trucks up in the air uh, fighting the fire from the outside. Not sure at this point if anyone was inside. We don't think so, uh, but we've got to verify that once we get the fire knocked down and can enter into the building. And about how long does this take for you to transition from defense mode to actually getting inside there? Yeah, it's going to take a while. Um, we've, we're having some issues with water supply and positioning our trucks. It was a secured facility, so we've had to go inside of the fence and uh, position our trucks in that location. So really our main priority right now is water supply, getting water to the fire and then getting inside and doing that search. So it looks like a large fire. When it comes to that, about where's that containment level, if you know? Yeah, what we're wanting to see is just make sure that the structure is stable before we go into it. Um, so that's what we're fighting with right now, just trying to get the main body of that fire knocked down, make sure the structure is stable before we enter. And then you also mentioned crews. There's a lot of people on the scene. Kind of talk us through how many people are out there trying to fight this fire. Yeah, we've we've went to a third alarm just for staffing. Uh, so we've got about 60 people out here now. Um, we're going to start rotating. Our shift changes about 8 o'clock. So we've got more firefighters coming in to work at 8 this morning. So uh, we'll be shifting out personnel here soon. And then again, fire still under investigation. Is that right? You know, any any causes? Yeah, no. No telling right now, uh, we have no idea. We've got our fire marshal out here now in our fire marshal's office, and uh, they're currently doing some interviews with people around and uh, starting that preliminary investigation. Um, and one thing you did mention too, this is an active company, right? They're still running, it's not an abandoned warehouse or anything like that. Yeah, as far as we know, this is uh, an active company and they have, uh, it's a secured facility. All the doors, uh, windows were secured. So uh, we feel good about uh, no one being inside. I think that's really well said. You know, the other thing, too, that you've mentioned, uh, the street closures. We have Oakland Avenue and McManus Street that are closed, Oakland Avenue and Park Terrace, Spring Garden Street and McManus Street, and Hyatt Street and Park Terrace. So just be sure to avoid the area. Thank you for talking with us. Um, I'm sure we'll be coming back for more updates as well.